one thing I forgot to I forgot to mention a few buttons here. I know I'm skipping all around tonight. I probably suck tonight, but let me go ahead and go through some of these. If you click on IntelliGuard, we have certain guards that uh, PC Tools uses to protect your machine. We have a, we have a behavior guard. Like I said, this is threat fire. Protection against zero day threats. That means threats that haven't even been identified yet. They just kind of look weird. And threat fire will identify those and ask you if you want to block them. Um, detects uh, malicious uh, behavior and such. You can also uh, disable this guard. You can view its history or you can uh, exclude certain processes. Certain things that you know are fine but you know uh, threat fire is getting in the way. I've got a browser guard. Protects your browser from malware. It works real well. Cookie guard. As I said in the past, cookies are nothing to even really think about. They're just a waste of people's time. I don't even know why they have this in here. Uh, email guard. Great for Outlook and Windows Mail. File guard. Of course, that's your that's your biggie. It's got a couple of options here. We can do all files and processes, processes only, processes and scripts. By default, we're on processes and scripts. I just kind of leave it there because PC Tools, uh, PC Tools is just flat out awesome. I just love their stuff, and, and I know they're kind of heavy on the RAM side, but man, they just do the, it. Just does the job. Gets it done, man. Uh, Immunizer Guard protects you against ActiveX. Network Guard. Host file protection. Uh, host file uh, protection. LSP protection. I mean, they cover it all right there, man. Process guard, malicious hidden processes, protects against rootkits. Site guard, this is uh, downloads. Uh, this automatically prevents you from going to spyware sites and phishing sites. Startup guard, takes a look at your startup folder, your registry, your startup files, and your task scheduler. Um, and then you've got uh, malware detective. If you click malware detective, you can go ahead and um, submit a log to them. You can s submit some files to them. Stuff that you really don't need to do because PC Tools takes care of almost everything on here. And like I said, I, I, I'm really, really, really happy with these guys because I've tested over a dozen apps this week and they mostly all suck completely. You know, it's it's they may clean up viruses, but that's it. You got to buy an additional application to take care of it. And I'm still going to review them. Um, I need to show the world what you know, what you should buy and what you shouldn't buy. So anyway, um, I love PC Tools and PC Tools with Internet Security just uh, adds adds on a bunch of great stuff like Threat Fire and a firewall and anti-spam. So that's 100% awesome application. I highly recommend you buy PC Tools with Internet Security or PC Tools Spyware Doctor with Antivirus. Just just an uh, just an amazing set of applications. What can I say? That's it. So uh, I have to go uh, get working on my other review here, and I'll um, talk to y'all later. See ya.